dare to enter Japan's longest and scariest horror house. Here are three survival tips. Japan is well known for its scary stories. In fact, a lot of their horror movies are recognized all over the world. If you are an avid fan of anything terrifying, Japan is definitely the place to go. One of the places you should check out is the super scary labyrinth of fear at Fujiku Highland, Japan's Yamanashi Prefecture. The super scary labyrinth of fear is a haunted house that is said to be the longest and the scariest house of horror in the world. The setting for this particular horror house is haunted hospital. The total distance of attraction from start to finish is approximately 900 meters and you will be allowed to walk freely and explore. Instead of machines, the super scary labyrinth of fear has a real people scaring you out of your wits. They will jump in front of you, scare you and even chase after you. If this sounds like something you would enjoy, then we'll highly recommend trying out this place. However, for those who have weak hearts when it comes to these kinds of things, but you would still like to go here, here are the three tips you should take note on when visiting this haunted house. Do not go alone. This tip is actually for everyone, not just those who are a little bit more scared. The super scary labyrinth of fear does not allow guests to enter alone. So if you want to experience this house of horror in Japan, make sure to grab a friend to go with you. Besides, if you're easily scared like I am, it's so much better to have someone to hold on to. Buy an omamori. If you want a middler version of the horror experience at the super scary labyrinth of fear, you don't actually have to waste backfully good money by going out of the haunted house early and not finishing the whole thing. There is actually a way for the ghosts not to scare you as much as the others. The horror house attraction sells a omamori outside. A omamori is a Japanese lucky charm for amulet, but in this case, the omamori that the super scary labyrinth of fear sells has a glow in a dark function and it glows once you're inside the haunted house. This glow will signal the actors playing the ghost that you bought the amulet and in turn, it will scare you less. The amulet is a bit expensive but it's a worth of try it to see if you can finish the course with it. You can buy underwear in the park. If you are a friend and you bought the omamori but still cannot finish the route, there is no shame in that. A lot of people give up because the super scary labyrinth fear is just that scary. There is a, there is a reason why they claim to be the scariest house of the horror in the world. The whole thing just makes you want to pee in fear. Speaking of peeing your pants, Japanese people are always prepared for anything and you bet they already thought about this scenario. That being said, there is a actually underwear being sold in stores at FujiQ. Highly just in case you encounter a little emergency situation while going through the super scary labyrinth of fear. Now that you are a little more prepared after reading those three tips, hopefully you have the courage to try this amorous horror house in Japan. It's not for everyone, especially not for the faint of heart, but it's a worth of a shot if you're looking for a bit of thrills.